Um, I think people are normally kind of taken aback. I'm normally the most recognisable guy in a room. Whilst I don't notice it, because what other people think of me isn't really my concern, I reckon I do turn heads. Hi, my name is Adam Pearson. I'm 28 years old, hailing from Croydon, greatest city on earth. And I work in film and TV. But the condition I have is called neurofibromatosis type 1 and it just causes excess body tissue to grow on nerve endings. Like I've got one in my hand there, I've got one on my arse that I'm not showing, but most of it's up on my face and upper torso. If you have a disfigurement, there's all these kind of myths and misconceptions that surround it, like I'm, I'm really brave or I'm really lonely, or things must be really difficult and I go home at night and put on REM, everybody hurts on repeat and I'm the dog and cry and no, that, that's not true. I'm very popular, I'm very geeky. Everyone thinks that I'm single because I have this figure. No, I'm single because I'm a nerd and I would rather play PlayStation and watch all six days on Avengers films end on end over a weekend than hang out with a girl. I'm not really bothered what complete strangers who I've never met and will never ever have anything to do with think of me and other people's ignorance is not and will never be my problem. Everyone's physical appearance to a degree affects who you are and who you become. We all, to a degree, are products of our environment and how people react to us based on how we look and who we are eventually affects that. It's just how much you let it affect you versus how much you let it define you. And whilst it does affect me, it has, hasn't and will never define me. And if anyone thinks because I look the way I do that I can't do certain things, well, watch me.